Yo, what's up? It's your girl, Star J Craziness. I'm back on this segment, Word on the Street. So, we're just going to kick it right into gear. Did y'all see Miss Taylor If You're Nasty? That's her new name for me, y'all. Taylor If You're Nasty, because she puts me in the mind of Janet Jackson mixed with Sierra. She, The girl, she doing a damn thing. I can just say that. Now, this video that premiered on the VMA Awards, and I'm going to definitely try to make a video for that, because some of that stuff was on there. It was like shocking special with that Drake and um, Rihanna thing, how she curved on him, you know. <laughs> She's like, you want to get these lips tonight on TV at that. So, but anyway... It ain't about them. So, yeah, the video, it started off like, what the hell is this? And then I see Miss Taylor, if you're nasty, she is bouncing around, gyrating, doing different kind of moves. She hit us with the African dance, and she hit us with the seductive dance, and she did some other stuff. I'm like, oh my goodness. I mean, you were serving booty and tits all day. Like... Really? And then the body, the abs? And I'm like, what? You just had a baby. How did that get snatched that quick? Like, tell us what you've been doing besides supposed to be exercising and eating right. Because, baby, that body was, oh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a big girl and I'm trying to get my body like that. I know it's going to take, you know, some uh good dieting and <laughs> training, but golly. And I'm like, it was just the other day, you was on my super sweet 16. Y'all remember that sweet 16? And she was looking like this. And I'm like, what the hell? Now she's looking like bow, 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 bow. You know, just everywhere. Like, girl, you were serving it to the females, making us want to get in the gym. Then you said, of course, you were serving it to the dudes. All they was probably focused on was your butt cheeks and tits. You know, that's their favorite thing. And then, I mean, you was doing a little Vogue thing. I was like, go on, girl, serve it up. But I can't say, I'm, then I kind of got confused. Because toward the end of the video, you, um, was basically, we're just going to say having sex with your, uh, boo thing. in the uh, look like the shower, uh, shower room. And I'm, I was a little confused on that. Then we get to this last part of the video where you and him and the baby are together and y'all looking like the jungle book type thing I, I just don't know where that part was going I, i'm just sorry but besides all that it was a very inter interesting video i'm surprised when you was doing this because this was supposed to be a um inspiration of flash dance the movie you didn't do the little uh, water scene, you know, she was on the chair and she let the little thing down and go whoosh and let it, I'm surprised you didn't do that because that was like a uh, epic moment in that um, scene from Flashdance. And then it kind of put me in the, um, what is it, what's the word I'm looking for? Jen Jackson, the uh, pleasure principle, you know that y'all. Yeah, it kind of put me in the mind of that. I'm like, okay, so that's your new name for me, Miss J uh, Miss Taylor. If you're nasty, because girl, I I was just floored. Like the whole video, my mouth was just like, what? Whoa! Like you just had a baby. Whoo, girl. What? What is your secret? Okay, because uh, it's a lot of females want to know. I mean that. Dang. If things was on fleek. But anyways, y'all tell me what y'all thought about the video. Um, once again, this was Kanye West's song. And he, uh, yeah. So just tell me what y'all think about the video. Make sure you leave it in the comment section below. As well as hit me up on Twitter. Hit me up on Instagram. And let your girl know what the business is okay so once again it's your girl star jack craziness and this is word on the street i'll see you on the next segment peace You know, me and Tara, we kind of had a little argument about my whole um, fit 
line I'm, you know, trying to put together and this and that. And she just don't know she really hurt my feelings. Like, you're supposed to be there for support and stuff like that. But you say you're doing constructive criticism, but in 